What's up guys, this is Sean here for another calculator tutorial and in this video tutorial I'll be going over how to find the future n value or uh, future year value using TVM Solver. Okay, so in order to go to TVM Solver you gotta press this button called apps on your calculator and the apps is located right next to a uh, green alpha key on your calculator and if you press apps you'll be brought into this applications tab right and if you look at the number one it says finance that's what we're gonna go for so hit enter and if you do that you'll see TVM solver on the first one so hit enter again okay so uh, in this video tutorial I'll be using this example here and go ahead and pause the video to read it over but those of you who have a smaller screen, let's read it. I'll read it for you. So it says Zach purchased a bond with face value of ten thousand dollar for four thousand two hundred dollar to build a new sports stadium. If the bond pays six point five percent annual interest compounded monthly, how long does he hold it until it reaches its full face value? Okay, so um, okay, so we got the all the information that we need to solve for the future value or the future year, right? So um, because we want to solve what the n is, we have to leave it as a zero. Okay, you can leave it. You can leave any number there, but just put something in there. The number, the I percentage means interest percentage and we had a 6.5 percent interest so put 6.5 and the present value is how much he have paid already and he've paid forty two hundred dollar out of ten thousand dollar right so we gotta put negative forty two zero zero and here you have to watch out for this negative sign because uh, if you put minus sign here it will give you an error so make sure you press that negative sign right under that number three keypad right below that number three keypad okay so type in minus forty two hundred and uh, payment will be zero because uh, we don't know that information right so just leave it as zero and the future value is a uh, ten thousand dollars so just put ten thousand dollars and uh, P dash Y and C dash Y those are stands for um, payment per year I think or uh, paying per year or something like that but what we're gonna put there is we're gonna put how many times the interest compounds in one year and uh, question said if you go back to question the question said it compounds monthly right which means for 12 uh, for one year it's gonna compound 12 times so we gotta put 12 and once you hit 12 notice the second one changes also so I guess those have to be same okay so we filled up everything except the uh, n value here and uh, in order to solve for n uh, here comes the magic so you have to press this alpha key the green one here and once you press the alpha key you have to hit this button called enter on your calculator so hit alpha and while on if you look on the screen once you hit alpha you'll see that this blank or the black cursor here it has letter A in it right it indicates that you pressed alpha and once you press alpha hit enter guess what you got uh, the uh, n value by magic it's cool huh okay so uh, if you wanted to that's how many months it takes him to pay off that ten thousand dollar so 160 month if you wanted to find how many years he would took you would have to just divide that 160.58 by 12 to find the yearly value 
And yeah, that's it for how to find the n value using TVN Solver. So if you guys have any other questions, please leave questions on the comment below. And uh, see you guys next time. Thanks.